Well, welcome to Monday afternoon, and I just got done listening to one of the most unintentionally hilarious interviews. I put interviews in air quotes on good old KCBS, the former legacy station. I heard the afternoon news anchors, Brett Burkhart, wow, and Patty Rising doing an interview with Mayor London Breed. And it was almost as if, I swear to God, this is like a Saturday Night Live comical sketch. It was so bad. And of course, they were talking about the big conference in town, uh, APEC, which starts officially tomorrow, but I guess everybody's kind of coming into town media and dignitaries the president's supposed to arrive later tonight so burkhart and patty rising are doing this interview with london breed and it was kind of like a cha- not kind of like it was it was like a chamber of commerce a chamber of commerce pr interview it wasn't really an interview it was more like you know, tell us how cool your city is. And of course, San Francisco has been getting a lot of crap for years now, a couple of years, because of the crime and, and all the various, you know, a lot of pandemic related issues that are confronting a lot of cities, but especially San Francisco. And I swear to God, this was like, again, this was a PR interview. So they're talking is Burkhart and Rising to London Breed. And they're talking about, again, APEC, and they asked uh, London Breed about what was taking place. Is San Francisco getting a better uh, chance now to showcase itself? And you had a very enthusiastic London Breed. Why wouldn't she be? Because they didn't ask about anything. Oh, Brett Burkhart, Mr. Wow. A former KGO retread who got back into broadcasting. Thanks, Jennifer Selig. Anyway, so Burkhart asked Mayor Breed about, um, off the top, I guess a journalist from out of town was held up, right, and at gunpoint. And, and, and Breed gave a very, you know, a very not unexpected, not surprising answer. Well, San Francisco's like big cities and, you know, and, uh, you know, we're going to have crime and, you know, the police, I'm sure, are going to are going to go out and make an arrest and all that. It was it, and, and they didn't challenge her. They didn't do any follow up. Uh, not one time. This was about a five minute interview. A puff piece would have been enjoyable. This was no puff beat. This was worse. You know, Mayor Breed, San Francisco, the the perception is that it's a very unsafe city and there is a lot of crime and, you know, the homelessness situation, which by the way, the city has kind of wiped off the whole area around Moscone Center and downtown because of this major conference, right? They didn't ask about that. They didn't, ask, they didn't ask about the protests, which is fine. But they didn't ask about the fact that the, their own residents, the own residents in San Francisco are ticked off about what's taking place, about not just the perception, the homelessness about around City Hall and that area and Market Street, all these businesses leaving and all that. But let's get back to the central point of this puff piece interview. Did they ask about either Burkhart or Rising about, well, what's going to happen when this APEC conference is over, which is Friday? Is it going to be business as usual? Mayor Breed, are you going to try to incorporate some of the things that you're doing now, such as sweeping homeless people in and around the area of Moscone? Are you going to try to better the city and maybe assuming this this conference, this major summit, and let's face it, it is a major summit. You have the leader of China coming. Uh, Biden's going to be here. Um, you have the world press is coming. Could they have at least asked 
some fairly innocuous but tenacious questions about that. No. It was as if they were both press liaisons for the mayor. And I get it. In order to get the mayor, they probably had to promise, oh, this is going to be a interview. Well, if that's the case, they shouldn't have done the interview to begin with. And the mayor, what's she going to do? She loved it. It's almost like a campaign speech for her. They don't ask any challenging questions. It was a joke. I'm not going to put the link up on this show. I want you to go to the KCBS website. I'm sure they're going to have it up later. And you tell me what what out now softballs this was like nerf balls and by the way this is not just the first time this has taken place the times that they've interviewed the mayor and i'm talking about burkhart and patty rising it's softball central or nerf ball central i get it now they have something to talk about with substance and that's this apec conference the summit that's taking place but and again, I realize this is not a time, God forbid, to go hard nose like a 60 minutes kind of interview with Mike Wallace going into some politician's eyes and asking tough questions. But my God, you're in a big city in San Francisco. Yes, you are hosting. Uh, they are hosting this Apex Summit. But my goodness, can't you ask a few questions? that are at least somewhat challenging to a mayor, by the way, who is very much, according to the various polls that you read, in danger of being voted out of office because of the very dilapidated state that is San Francisco. Now it's getting a little bit better. Um, we have some conferences coming. The All-Star Game and the NBA is coming next year, which, of course, they asked her about that. But could they not have asked about the present the present state of San Francisco? Mayor Breed, you've got this major apex summit granted, which should probably showcase the best parts of San Francisco. But what about the reality? What about at least the perception that San Francisco is in some dire straits with drug use, with homelessness, with businesses left and right moving away from Market Street, with restaurants saying business is way down. Some restaurants saying, yeah, business is back to pre-pandemic normalcy. Okay, that's fine. Instead, you get this sophomoric, ridiculous cheerleader, almost five minutes of, BS is what you got on KCBS. Am I surprised? Nah, because that's KCBS these days.